Hey everybody, it's Mara from Matter Hackers, and this is your Matter Hackers Minute. The Museum of Science and Industry has been an institution of curiosity and learning in the heart of Chicago since 1933. They recently hosted their first Spring Make Festival, which I got to go to. Activities ranged from a scrappy, quick-build robot competition to a full-blown mini-maker fair. My favorite hands-on activity, of course, involved a wall of 30 Flashforge Finder 3D printers and a whole lot of fun. The Make Shop exhibit was the most well-run maker experience I've ever seen, basically transforming a black box space in the museum into a fabrication workshop set up to accommodate over 600 visitors per day. Here's how it worked. Groups of visitors were assigned a time to meet at the Make Shop where they would build a personalized wearable, this name badge. First stop was the 3D printing station. Computers were set up for guests to write their name on the screen with their finger using a program called 3D Paint. Next, their name was sliced using flash print software, and each file was saved on a USB thumb drive with a number corresponding to a printer. Then it was off to the massive rack of 3D printers to find your number. The USB drive got placed into the printer, and we got to watch our creations get 3D printed in only six minutes. Kids and adults alike were mesmerized at the process of depositing plastic layer by layer to make something they had just created themselves moments ago. Once the print was done, we grabbed the handy spatulas hanging next to the printers to remove our creations, and we headed off to the vinyl cutters. Families from all over the world chose an image from a few different options like a rocket ship, a heart, a bird, and some others. We dragged our shapes into the designated spot on the computer screen and watched as our images were sent to the vinyl cutters on the table and then produced right on the spot. The third step was to create a circuit using an LED light and a battery to place behind our 3D printed panel. Once all the pieces were assembled, the final touch was to add a string and wear our creations proudly throughout the rest of the day at the museum. This well-run factory as exhibit was the brainchild of the Wanger Family Fab Lab team, working with other museum departments and led by Fab Lab manager Dan Meyer. Museum exhibits typically take up to two years to develop, but the Make Shop team brought this one to life in only five months. The exhibit itself is an example of design thinking, iteration, and celebration of failure as long as you learn something. It was originally set up with the vinyl cutting activity first, but after a few practice runs, they moved 3D printing front and center for a better workflow. They even have a little display of prints gone awry to remind themselves that sometimes new creations and technologies need a few tries to get just right. Though the Make Shop exhibit has now ended, be sure to check out the Fab Lab at the museum to create and 3D print your own creature to take home. I, for one, can't wait to see where 3D printing pops up next. Have you seen 3D printers available in surprising places near you? Please leave me a comment. I'd love to hear about it. I'm Mara, and this has been your Matter Hackers Minute. Go be awesome. Thank you for watching. If you liked that, subscribe to our channel to keep up to date with all of our videos. And remember, go to matterhackers.com to shop for everything 3D printing.